your name is? Craig Murray. Your occupation? Company director. And your chosen subject? Alan Partridge. Alan Partridge, that inept, hapless, and often obnoxious fictional broadcaster created by Steve Coogan. Here we go. What's the name of the conductor played by the musical director Steve Brown, who leads the house band on Alan Partridge's television chat show Knowing Me, Knowing You? Glenn Ponder. Yep. In the day-to-day, Alan tries to explain the group system for the 1994 Football World Cup with the help of a complicated studio prop. What name does he give it? Uh, Pass. In the film Alpha Papa, the radio station North Norfolk Digital is taken over and renamed Shape. What's the name of the media company that has bought the station? Gordial Media. Yep. Alan's given an opportunity to take over as the co-host of the magazine programme this time because of the illness and subsequent death of its long-serving male presenter. What's his name? John Buskell. Yep. In Knowing Me, Knowing You, when Alan chose a chaotic question-time-style debate before the West Chalfont by-election, he reveals that one candidate... Of telling Colonel Kojak Slaphead the Third is actually a student named Martin from which university? Uh, Birmingham. Warwick. In the series I'm Alan Partridge, during his lunch with Tony Hayes, Alan proposes a number of new programme ideas for the BBC, including a regional detective series set in Norwich. What title does he suggest for the series? Sparrow. Swallow. In Knowing Me, Knowing Yule, what's the name of the television chef who irritates Alan with her constant use of outrageous innuendo? Alan later reveals she's actually a failed disc jockey named Peter Willis. Uh, Fanny Thomas. Yes. In Open Books, Alan discusses how book titles that accurately describe the plot are useful to potential readers. Which book does he suggest would have saved a lot of time if it had been called Church Puzzle Collection? Pass. During an interview at Marple Racecourse for the day-to-day, a jockey explains that he's actually 33 years old and not, as Alan believes, a schoolboy. What's the jockey's name? Uh, John O'Humphreys. Nicky Doolan. In the climactic scene of Alpha Papa set on a seaside pier, Alan distracts his armed fellow DJ Pat Farrell by singing a song that Pat has previously dedicated on air to his late wife. Which song? You Are Always On My Mind. Yes. You had two passes, Craig. It would have been easier to call the Da Vinci Code the church puzzle collection, and that gadget in the studio on the uh, World Cup programme was the soccer meter. Yes. You have uh, scored now, Craig, five points.